Okay, so welcome. I mean, you guys are probably here because you just created your channel, and if you did, congratulations. I'm really excited for you guys to start this journey. It's an amazing platform to, to upload videos on YouTube to make a difference. And if you guys haven't yet, I'm really excited to see what you guys can do with your channel and when you create it. Make sure to comment down below what channel you guys actually have and what you guys plan on doing with that. Now, if you guys already have a channel, you might have uploaded it once, or you might just be kind of presented with the question of what happens when you have zero subscribers, zero views, or even just zero videos and you don't know what to do with it. And it can be really mind-boggling. Maybe you upload your first video and you only get two views. You expect it to be an instant hit. hit. And honestly, we all feel that in a way. It'd be really cool to just have a thousand subscribers and a thousand views just out of nothing. But unfortunately, that's not life. Unfortunately, we all have to work for it and we all have to learn. But don't worry, I mean, I was there, I was sitting there hitting F5 on my keyboard, just refreshing it day after day, minute after minute, waiting to see those views go up, waiting to see these comments roll in because it's something that I've dreamed about, it's something that I've watched other, subs other other YouTubers grow and get bigger and be able to do. And I know I'm not the craziest YouTube channel right now, I'm only at 120 subscribers, but that's just now. You know, you guys could be watching this in a few years down the road, it could be a lot bigger, and hopefully I'll be able to do that and make a difference. And that's not the point of the video. The point of the video is about you guys, and you guys starting from zero subscribers, zero watch hours. So let's get into it. For step number one, you guys are probably thinking that you know PewDiePie has a massive following and you need some sort of massive following on Instagram, Twitter, if you're gonna be having a YouTube channel. You might need some crazy Twitch you know, following if you wanna have a successful YouTube channel. That's honestly not the case. While that's really important, I think that could really help you out in some ways and it might take some stress off to get those first 100 subscribers for 1,000. At the end of the day, a lot of us start from zero. Now, with that being said, I want you to, I want to make sure that you guys appreciate all your subscribers. And what I mean by that is, you know, we've all been there. We've commented on bigger YouTube channels. We've commented on some other YouTube channels, and it just feels like we're talking into a wall. Wow, I really like that video. This is the best content I've ever seen. And then it's nothing. You basically get nothing back. You don't even get a heart, not even a like from that content creator. And you feel like you kind of wasted your time commenting on there and actually trying to create a personal relationship. I know I might be taking this a little bit different way than what you might want to do or what some other content creators want to do, but I always want to appreciate my, my followers and I want to appreciate the fact that they took the time to comment. That's why you should see in all my videos that I do try to go out there, comment, and have some sort of personal relationship. I know this will get harder down the road, but it's, it's something that I'm willing to do. There's a lot of people, 3 million subscribers, trying to comment to their followers and everything like that, just to try to have that personal relationship. Because at the end of the day, those are the people that are watching, and those are the people that are going to make you big. Those are the people that are going to swear by you. And you want to create a great relationship with them so they do swear by you. And that segues us right into the sponsor of this Motivational Monday episode, Benny. I love Car Quickie. You guys should really subscribe to him. He really makes great content. And that takes us to step number two. So thumbnails and titles to the video. If you think about your YouTube channel like a storefront, you're not gonna wanna be having a really poor storefront with broken windows, with no door, or you don't wanna be giving off a poor impression of what you guys work so hard to do. With nothing like spending two to four hours on a video trying to make some great content, and then you just title your video, Puppies Are Cute, and well, puppies are cute, and that I could argue that to the death of me, and you just have some really not cute puppy on there. No, your title should be Golden Retriever Puppies must watch. You want the viewer to kind of ask themselves a question, why should why should I watch this video? Really? Are Golden Retrievers the best puppy? Let's watch this and let's find out. Now, for secret number three, I feel like I shouldn't have to say this, but it's something that we all struggle with and something we all really have a full grasp on, and it's quality and quantity. And it's not one of those quantity over quality or just quality over quantity, because if you upload once every two months, but it's like some five minute video and I don't care if it's some greatest thing since Steven Spielberg, I think you do need to upload a little bit more. And I'd say at least once a week if you're really trying to grow that channel and once you have it established, you can dial, you can dial back from there. Now what I mean by quality is I mean actual videos. I don't want to see a one minute video where you're not really getting to the point of the video and you're just kind of uploading and saying, here's Mr. Pumpkin. Great talk, Mr. Pumpkin. 
I want to see a real video about why Mr. Pumpkin is the greatest pumpkin in the world and why he really has the greatest smile. You know why he has the greatest smile? Because he smashed that like button and he subscribed to the channel. With that being said, you want to also be uploading, like I said, a few times a week. If you want to do it, start with once a week and you just want to get yourself established, I think that's great. And I think eventually down the road, while you're still growing this channel, we need to be uploading a few times a week and have some great quality video. Now you could say this video has come full circle, and with that being said, I would completely agree with you. You are not wrong. And that's pretty much all there is for this video, so all that's left to do is for you guys to have an amazing day.